I get my frog in. May I interest one of you in my wacky worm? right over here. I got him. That one went for my worm. Oh, this other one's chasing him. Come on, chase him all the way up. That other one's a little bit bigger, I think. Chase him all the way up into my net. Look at that. I got three of them. All right, I'm going to get this one in. I almost netted his buddy there, too. <laughs> Well, we'll start with that one. We'll get this guy in and then go see if we can catch a couple of his friends. Jeez, that is a beauty of a fish. We'll get a quick measure on that one. It's about 19 and just over a quarter. Nice big bass on the wacky worm. Yeah, that right there is why I pretty much always have a wacky worm tied on when I'm fishing one of these lakes with real clear water like this. I can just paddle around and see those fish swimming around. All right, I gotta see if I can find his friends now. And two of them chased him up as I was fighting that one, but not sure where they went. We'll see if we can find them. There's a little blue gun right there. You guys, there's a big bass sitting right here in front of me.
got him. Oh, that was sick. I knew he was gonna eat that worm. <laughs> Took a few casts, but I got him. Well, I think that settles it. It's gonna be a wacky worm day today. Jeez, look at that bass. Yeah, I was just sitting here up shallow, retying real quick, and this guy swam up pretty much right next to me. Just hung out there for a minute while I got retied. Threw that worm at him a couple of times and watched him come right over to it and inhale it. Man, that is so much fun. Nice big bass on the wacky worm. Yeah, they cannot say no to that Senko. I mean, crystal clear water, I'm just paddling around, watching for these big bass, get right up next to them, drop that worm and watch them munch it. Well, I spent a few hours fishing topwater out here this morning. I had zero luck with that. So I think we're just gonna keep paddling around up shallow. We'll see if we can find another big bass or two to throw that wacky worm in front of and hopefully we'll get to watch him eat it. There's a few. Kicking myself for not bringing my power pole anchor. solid rock down there. I was going to try to dig my paddle in, but I don't think that's going to be an option here. Got him. Oh, that was cool. I saw that one closing in on my worm. I had it right behind the rock there. Come here, you. Well, he shook my worm, but that's all right. That is another quality fish right there.
We'll get a quick measure on that one. He's probably 18, huh? 19, right on the line there. Pretty fish. All right, I'm gonna get myself set up with a new worm because I know he's got at least a couple of buddies right over here. All right, I know there's still at least a couple of big bass pretty much right down here next to me. This wind is making it real tough to try to stand up and fish and stay on my spot with no anchor. So we're gonna sit and just take a few casts out there. There's one of them. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Come here, bud. Well, we got a couple out of that school at least. It's giving out wacky worm mustaches out here today. Another beautiful fish. About the same size as that other one too. We've all been right around 19 inches. That one's a little bit over 19 and a quarter. Just nice, thick bass though. All kinds of fun to catch those. Well, I think that's gonna do it for today's trip. The wind is really starting to pick up. It's making it tough to see those fish and even tougher to try to sit still long enough to catch one if I do see one. But the wacky worm pulled through once again. It's kind of a rough start this morning. I spent the first three, four hours out here tossing several different topwater lures. I was completely skunked doing that. First big bass I saw swim by me, I dropped that wacky worm in front of him and watched him inhale it. So we were able to do that several times today. Caught a handful of nice largemouth. Yeah, that's a fun way to catch them. I sure enjoyed it. I hope you guys did too about that time for me to paddle back to the launch. So thanks for coming along with me again. I'll see you next time.